Single sign-on allows you to access a number of services using your network password. Currently, we use our single sign-on service to allow you to use the same username and password to access the internet through our proxy or web filter. To access our file servers such as Baby Bear, Papa Bear, Mama Bear, Ursa using the same username and password. And to log into your computer whether you are on the academic or business network using the same username and password. And starting uh, soon, uh, we will also be adding Google Apps, including Calendar, Docs, Mail, uh, and Gmail, which will allow you to use the same username and password to log into your email service. So what does that mean? Well, it will look something like this. You'll go ahead and type in the address of uh, Google Docs. In this case, I'm going to uh, select the Calendar service. It will take you to a single sign-on uh, space and you're going to go ahead and choose the correct domain you belong to. For most users it's likely you belong to the academic uh, domain. For some users in our business office and institutional advancement office uh, they may belong in the business domain. Go ahead and put in the correct username and network password that you've been using all along to access your computer, the file server, or the internet and select login. In a few moments you will log into, and in this case, I'm logging into my calendar service uh, through Google. One way to save you having to keep another password. Hope you enjoy.